A street outreach doctor in Kenora is concerned about a sharp increase in HIV cases among people who use drugs there. Dr. Johnny Greck says support for programs like the Needle Exchange is key to curbing transmission. He's encouraging the community to consider those who are at risk. If it also feels right to you to be able to help people who use drugs and to help that population who are affected by this, then that will absolutely positively impact what the future of, of HIV and AIDS looks like in Northwest Ontario. You can, uh, you can make a big difference just by lending a hand. Greg voiced his concern at a recent council meeting on public safety. He says he's aware of 16 people who have been diagnosed with HIV since March. The Northwestern Health Unit says it's not aware of all of those cases, but has confirmed nine cases over the past year, which is more than the previous nine years combined. The NWHU says sharing needles and drug use equipment, as well as unprotected sex, are the main risk factors. Dr. Greck wants an open conversation in the community about HIV and drug use in general, saying education and removing the stigma is key. So that is needle exchange, that is supervised consumption sites, they are essential to help with this issue. Um, there is a, a totally side conversation about safer opiate supply uh, prescribing as well, which I'm a big uh, advocate for. Um, and that is another harm reduction strategy that can change how we think about people who use drugs. That in turn can prevent a HIV diagnosis. Greg emphasizes with modern treatments, people with HIV can live a normal life, comparing the daily medication to a high blood pressure regimen.